Live from the world's capital markets, here are the latest financial headlines brought to you by BYOB Trading Academy. Hello and welcome to Tuesday's Daily Financial Digest. The dollar index climbed, building on four straight weeks of gains after the US government temporarily avoided a shutdown and economic data continues to support the view the US Federal Reserve will keep rates higher for a longer period of time. New figures showed Eurozone inflation fell to its lowest level since October 2021. It tumbled to 4.3% for the month of September. The ECB hiked interest rates to a record level last month, but economists and investors expect them to have now reached their peak. The United Auto Workers' ongoing strike against Ford, General Motors and Stellantis is in its third week and has already cost the US economy nearly $4 billion, with workers losing $325 million in wages. The dollar-yen pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.1%. The MACD is giving a positive signal which matches our overall technical analysis. The Bitcoin dropped 0.4% against the dollar in the last session. According to the stochastic RSI, we are in an overbought market. The gold-dollar pair plummeted 1.1% in the last session, the CCI indicates an oversold market. The oil dollar pair dove 2.7% in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an oversold market. The US JOLTS job openings will be released at 1400 hours GMT. The US Red Book Index at 1255 GMT. Spain's unemployment change at 0700 hours GMT. Japan's 10Y bond auction will be released at 0335 GMT. Australia's RBA interest rate decision at 0330 GMT. Australia's RBA rate statement at 0330 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Tuesday's financial report. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.